Whoa, 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 it's dark. Yes, yeah, so my camera, as you can see, is right, really pretty horrible right now because. Oh, yeah, it's all the way out. Horrible right now because it's very light sensitive, it's very dark. So I have both my lights on in my car, which is bad. You're not supposed to do that. Um, so don't. I'm only doing it so you can see me. I am about halfway to Milwaukee. Everybody, Milwaukee. Maybe I should get to the other lane. Um, to visit our good friend JT at college. And yeah, I left. I worked uh, 5 to 10 today. And then as soon as I got off, I went home because I had to pick up something I had forgotten. Um, and now I'm on my way. And I am in Wisconsin right now, I believe. Um, and I will get there tonight and we will party it up and then we're gonna hang out all day tomorrow um, you'll get plenty of footage so stay tuned for now I have to focus on driving yes I just I just have to here with JT in his suite, as they call it, with his roommate Joe. JT! College. Hmm? Yeah, I just go to the community college uh, in our hometown. <laughs> um, Who wants yeah, to be a writer? So that's it for now. Everyone, please help me explain the rules of dibs to JT. I laid in his bed and said dibs. Joe, do I get his bed? I'm not part of this conversation. Oh, but you are now part of the conversation. JT? Yeah. You gotta look. No, I'm stealing music from my friend right now. You just said that on camera. I really don't care. JT, you gotta look. You gotta look or else it won't work. Yeah, so I got this weird red thing out of my face and it's, it doesn't I don't feel it and it doesn't hurt to push on it or anything it's just a red mark look at my eyes now people are gonna think I'm high that's great Audience, that's inappropriate. That is inappropriate. <laughs> I'm here with my best bud, JT. Hello. In Milwaukee, and it's college. Where I go to school. There it is. Well, not school. That's just the. That's where I live. What is? What is it called? A residence hall. A residence hall. Right. That's where his dorm is. <laughs> I met his roommate, as you saw, and there was sort of an, a chilling kind of after party thing that we just kind of sat in last night. That's kind of cool. Yeah. And this morning we went back to that same room and we just kind of sat there again, just kind of talked and hung out. College is a pretty cool place. I mean, I just go to community college and it's just school and then you go home. This is, you know, this is where you guys live. You hang out, you're together. And I think I might try it after, you know, I finish at uh, my school. Hopefully yeah. here. Oh, we went into... I don't know if I could really say into town because we're in the town right now. Yeah, we just City, kinda, we walked of, around. Yeah, we walked away from where the residence hall is into where more shops and stuff are. But he showed me this cool music center called the Exclusive Company. The exclusive Company. Um, and I got a nice fish CD and a book because it's always nice to read. Those are things you did. And now we're just kind of on a trail behind the residence hall. And you know terms. I'm proud of you. Thank you. We're going to go get people, and we're going to go to the mall, because we're going to Barnes & Noble, because... They have a John Green table set up. Yes. Hopefully. We're not sure. I don't know if it was all of them, um, but I saw on Tumblr, because I am behind a watch of Wall Brothers, but I saw on Tumblr that uh, they have stuff. And, oh, also, I, I wanted to tell you, they have... Uh, they're releasing like these box sets of John Green's books and stuff and they may or may yeah, not come with uh, um, a signed copy of Tiffios and what else? I don't remember. Something else is going to be signed. They're looking for the looking for Alaska cover, didn't it? 
Did you see the video about how he doesn't I like didn't. the handle? I didn't. I didn't, but I'm I... pretty sure the Looking for Alaska cover on the hardcover in the box set uh -huh. doesn't have the candle on it because really? the publisher uh, said, "Oh, that looks too much like cigarette smoke." And John Green was like, "Well, yeah, that's because yeah. it's supposed to be cigarette smoke." And they were like, "No, we can't put that on bookshelves. We're gonna put a candle on there." So really, that yeah. I was I've just been wanting about that forever. And it's getting dark. Yeah, he made a video about it, and uh, so... But I was like, what does a candle have to do with anything in that story? Yeah. Okay, yeah, because, I mean, there's... Well, I mean, the There's a big part about smoking out, so and stuff. Know. Which kind of relates to your life now. There's... He's at a, a school away from home, and there's influences and stuff. I'm not saying if he's partaking, I don't know. Um, I've done but, a lot of cocaine in the last week. So okay, then. that's a thing. I have a job... Which you guys, I don't know if you know, I don't, because I have, I've made videos and I just haven't put them up. And I may have put them up before I put this one up, or I may just put this one up and get this one done. Because this one's more important, because it's uh, the opening to us coming back and vlogging, yeah. hopefully, because uh, now we're... James Me Johns 2.0. Yeah, we're coming um, back, because uh, we're at separate schools now, we don't get to hang out and talk to each other all the time. And we're not going to know what's going on in each other's lives and stuff. Um, so we're gonna bring that back. Hopefully, it won't just be us talking about us uh, or because he's got stuff. a job and in, in college, and I'm in college and in a city, and yeah. there are a lot more interesting things than both of us in Crystal Lake doing nothing. Yeah, we need to research more, like topics yeah. to talk about, and like actually write out what we're gonna say. I don't know. Maybe you probably did a little bit. I didn't. I at really all. didn't at all. I just no. kind of sat there and did it. Um, I mean, like, I thought about it sometimes, what I was going to say, but I never, like, wrote it down. Yeah. The cool part about um, you being here and having these people right next door is you can, if, uh, you know, since they met me, uh, we're not friends, they just met me, but if they were like, oh, that guy was kind of cool, I guess. They can watch us. They can watch me. They Maybe can they're come watching on his right video. Now. They could say hi. Um, you know... Uh, if I make any friends at college, I mean, it's kind of uh, high school 2.0 because it's, like I said, it's your classes and then you go home because it's just community college. It's pretty simple. Uh, I don't, you know, I'm not surrounded by people. I'm not forced to be social. I don't have a new roommate. Um, but, uh... You know what's really awful? What? Uh, because you're taller than me. Yeah. And now because the camera is closer to you, your head is bigger than mine also. You just seem like a bigger, better, more awesome person. Carl the Giant from uh, Big Fish. Good movie. That is a good movie. I love that movie. That's a really great movie, actually. Uh, I hear this up. We need to go to the mall soon. Yeah, we got to go to the mall. Uh, uh, we're at the mall. We're at the mall. Woo! We're done now. Yeah. We bought books. Yep, books. And and these are the bags that the books came in. Not the went books to the Halloween store, and that's it. We went to Barnes and Noble, looking for a John Green table, but it wasn't there. No, it was not. But they had some of his books there. Yes, that is true. Very nice. But yeah, but uh, I got the Psychopath Test, which I heard was pretty great. And I got the complete screenplays of the Dark Knight trilogy. Amazing. I also Amazing. Got I also got a different book, which is pretty sweet, but uh, I don't give anything away. But yeah, we're waiting for the bus now. Go back to the residence hall. Bam. Residence hall. I'm I proud did it. Of you. I did it. Okay. The rules are: the videos need to be between two and six minutes because, let's be honest, nobody wants to watch another one of your 16-minute videos of you walking through your house. Same as before, punishments, uh... I still have to do the cinnamon challenge. I will do that. Same as before, punishments, uh, if you don't make a video or if you fail a challenge, we can challenge at any time. And you're on Tuesdays and I'm on Fridays. Because I don't have classes on Fridays and I don't know why you... I'm free Tuesdays because Tuesdays I work every day except Tuesday, Thursday. Right, that is a thing that is true. I was going to say that all challenges are null and void. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. What are you doing? Filming you. I don't believe you, but okay. If you still want to do the cinnamon challenge, that's fine. What? 
Is that all? I think so. Yeah, okay. That's it. Stayed another night. It is now Monday morning. JT has to get to class and I have to go home and sit on my butt until I work at five. Quite exciting. Um did I have my camera with me last night? We got back here. I went and checked on my car. And then we came back. Just kinda hung out with all his buddies. In six oh three. Um, and then we spent the, like, hours, like, later at night, playing a game. What happened in that game doesn't leave that room. That's, well, that's not the point. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna say what people said. The point of the, because I've played this game before. The, the, it's a game I came up with, and it's called, uh, Who the F Are You? And it's just a fun game to, when you meet new people, to just get to know them, you go around and uh, you say something about yourself and you slowly get more personal. Now, what is said in the game is between you and whoever else is playing that game. You don't spread that around because that would not be nice at all. I wouldn't want them saying to people things I said and I know they don't want me sharing with you all or anyone else what I said or what they said. JT, any final thoughts? Uh, it was very fun. What a long, strange trip it's been. <laughs> very intriguing, JT. Um, yeah, then we just came back here and slept. <coughs> and woke up, and we just kind of talked. That's what we did this morning, was just talking. We didn't do anything. And it wasn't like a big conversation, it was just talking. <sighs> and now I'm finishing my packing up and I'm on my way. So, I mean, unless there's any more, I give. Probably not. See you on Tuesday. See the seasons change, I wish they didn't have to Time could just stand still the Skies could always stay blue And with November comes the clouds My winter has arrived the snow begins to fall I have to say goodbye Now I've reached my December the cold is setting in Sky is growing darker, I am getting thin. When December's over, I don't know where I'll go. January's waiting, so I can clear the snow.